Hey everyone, how was that last drink? Did you actually make it? The Salido, Salindo? It was a great drink. If I pronounced it, Lord forgive me. But today we're gonna make a Cosmo. Old fashioned with a little citron twist on it. So the Cosmo actually originated with this popular series Sex in the City and it got its fame and popularity from that. Ever since then, girls, queens, men alike, all ordered the Cosmos at the bars, at the local bars. So since you can't go to the bars and order one, I want to show you how to make it. So of course you need your martini shaker. Put that here. I also have my side pan, so I'll, what you can't see here, I'll have it close up for you amongst your very eyes. You'll also need about one ounce of lime juice. I already took the pleasure in juicing those limes for you. You need one ounce of cranberry juice. If you want to make this a little bit less sugary, you can use sugar-free cranberry juice. But Mama's thirsty and she just took whatever she could find in the cupboard. So I'm using sugar cranberry. Yeah! And then you're going to use some citron kettle wand. I'll put that in the camera. I love this vodka. You can use this for lemon drops. You can use this for shots. It's great. So you need two ounces of the Citron Kettle One. Last thing you need, and I love drinks. I love these type of drinks that are only one and two or three ingredients. It's great to have these type of drinks in your arsenal if you have a party, something quick and simple, you know? You don't want to struggle with like five different ingredients and you have like 10 people at your house. That's no bueno. The last ingredient, and I promise, is Contro, Contro. You need about one ounce of that. And it's basically an orange liqueur. That's all the ingredients you need. Put that in your shaker and shake it up. Now, here's a tip for you. When you feel the shaker getting ice cold to your hand, that's when you can stop. But if you don't, baby, just keep on shaking that motherfucker. <laughs> Until the lid pops off. Woo! Getting a workout. And you see, I have my boobs in like I did last time I was tired, but baby, this time I'm energized and I got these bad boys in. All right, you get your martini glass, and I have a special little swimmer. Oh, he's barely hanging on. His name is Mitch. <laughs> it's cute. He has these little swim trunks with Mitch on his booty butt. <laughs> All right, so then you just pour, and hopefully everything stays on nice and tight. And don't spill over this beautiful bar. Look at that. And it should like look like a bright iridescent red color. It should look like a bright pink color. Maybe not red. <laughs> and there you go, folks. That is my little twist on a good old-fashioned classic called the Cosmo. Let's go in for the spill and the kill. So good. You taste the Cointreau. You taste all the ingredients. You taste the lime juice. They all marry so well. Now I can see why this was a Sex in the City classic and favorite. Mm. Try this. Let me know if you like it. If you never had a Cosmo, it's super easy to make. Don't forget to tip your bartender. My cash app is drinks with destiny, dollar sign drinks with destiny. If you don't tip, it's fine. I just want you guys to laugh, enjoy the show, share the video, 
because if you loved it, then you share it. Can I get an amen? Amen. <laughs> amen. All right. So I'm going to get out of here before RuPaul sends me a royalty uh, lawsuit. But I love everyone and all of you. Till next time. And remember, stay inside. Life's way too short. Life's way too short for a boring cocktail. And why go to the bar if you can just make them at home? Mwah! <laughs>